get we rolling i'm ready for it guys i hope you guys are ready for it as well super excited this is a unboxing of a saber trio lightsaber i just received this in the mail and i cannot wait to unbox this saber um i have been anticipated this saber for a good well and uh it's just ah oh, it's finally here oh the guys at saber trio did an amazing job um if you didn't know about uh, Saber Trio yet, I highly recommend to check them out. I will put the link in the description of the video. And uh, we're gonna of course do a full review of this uh, lightsaber as well. Um, but uh, that will be the end of this week. Um, this will be one of those videos that I uh, just uh, do in between. And what I mean is because I'm so happy with this lightsaber, I wanted to have this unboxing video out the same day as I receive it. So the day that you guys are watching this, uh, today it's, uh, what is it, 24 October uh, on a Tuesday. That is actually when I received the lightsaber as well. So um, my colleague and my work uh, uh, was very excited as well he's like oh open the box open the box i said no i cannot do that i need to do it on video he's like what he didn't really grasp the concept that i want to do it for youtube uh which of course is a little bit understandable because how many people do unboxing videos only when they have a video available but <laughs> it's it is what it is uh but i really wanted to share my uh my pleasure and my enthusiasm Enthusiasm, enthusiasm. Jeez, I, I can never pronounce that word. It's such a hard word for me to pronounce. Enthusiasm, enthusiasm. My English is not my first language, so <laughs> I'm sorry for that. Okay, here we go. Very good packing. So, um, yeah. Okay, we, we're not there yet. We are not there yet. Oh God, I'm so excited. I'm really, really excited. Okay, we've done it. Okay, so we got the box here. So first for most, I want to say this is a really cool box. It says on the box, it says uh, we have Saber Trio, the logo, as you can see here. That's pretty cool. And it says uh, Saber Trio on the front. And on the back it says, this weapon is your life. Try not to lose it. That's cool. That's uh, a quote from uh, the prequel movies, which uh, actually that scene, I was looking at it the other day, I think two days ago, where Obi-Wan said that to uh, Anakin uh, during the chase. And it also has something here. Ah, oh, cool, they wrote down, they write down the name of the customer. So in this case, they wrote down my name, Jeroen, and then Rebel Trumps. So that's really cool. So let's open the box up. Um, let me adjust the camera a little bit in so you guys can see it at the same time as me when I open the box. That would be an, uh, a really cool thing to do, I guess. So let's see how that works out. Uh, that works pretty well, uh, my hair relaxed, but hey, it has to do, here we go. I'm very excited guys, this is also the first time I gonna see the inside and the containments of this box. Um, yeah, let's do it. Ooh, that's cool, man. That's neat. Wow, that's very neat. I didn't expect that to be so neat. Um, so what we got here, hope you guys can see that, is uh, uh, Alan Rens keys in a uh, small bag with uh, two Alan Rens key uh, screws. So one for the uh, LED unit and one for the blade retention screw. Uh, two different sizes of uh, uh, Allen Rens keys. So that will come in very shortly. We have a wall charger and not just a shabby one. This is actually a proper one that comes with all kinds of inserts for different uh, power plugs. So the Brit power plug, the European power plug and the US power plug. So that's really good. Now in Hong Kong, we actually use the same Brit type. That is um, a, uh, a two pronged style. So we use this one in Hong Kong and um, I believe it's just a uh, click on system. Now I've never seen this kind of system, but I believe, yep, oh, that was super easy. So um, we're ready to charge the lightsaber after a lot of uh, fun playing it. So put that to, a si to the side for a moment. Then it also, wow, it also comes with a blade plug, guys. This is a real complete set, unbelievable. Um, so let me open this uh, blade plug here. So 
uh, well packed, so I need to use my uh, trusty scissor again. Snip it to uh, there. And here we go. Ooh, oh, that's a nice design. That's really neat. Wow, that's a cool lightsaber blade plug. So I hope you guys can see it. Hopefully it's not blurry. That's really neat. That's a very nice blade plug. Let me just uh, make sure we are uh, zoomed in and delved into the box because uh, sometimes uh, the uh, camera on the I uh, on an uh, iPhone does uh, do weird things. So that's really cool. So we have a blade plug. We have a charger with different insert pieces. So wherever you are in the world, you have uh, charging options. Uh, Allen wrench keys and um, what else we got? We got a blade as well. So we got a, a dust cap for the blade. Uh, itself that's really nice that's a good good thing i uh, love that and uh, this is a 20 i think a 28 inch blade if i'm not mistaken i think it's a trans white blade really nice it has a rounded tip i like that and it has actually uh, the foil which is loose here yep the foil is here so hard to show it's like a vader's fold blade so that's good. It's not uh, glued in just like uh, a saber force or ultra sabers. I actually prefer this type because it's uh, it's most often uh, giving a better brightness uh, in terms of uh, the the finish, and you don't have a blob of glue inside of the uh, blade itself. So that's nice. It's a, a nice sturdy blade. It's a lighter blade, so it's definitely for uh, light tapping, light uh, light dueling, and uh, mainly for cosplay and display. Of course, if you want to have a uh, an heavy dueling blade, then you, need, you can get that as well uh, from them. So this is the containment of the box, nicely uh, compartment in different sections in the box. So uh, after you play it with your lightsaber, you also have the chance to just put it back in the box. That's really cool. I like that uh, whole concept of having a box there. And now is the uh, main moment of uh, excitement. That is the hilt. So uh, it has already nice heft to it. It feels really nice in the hand. And um, let's open it up and see what's inside. Ooh, I'm really excited for this, guys. You cannot, I cannot describe really how excited for this hilt I am because um, I fell in love with Saber Trio as soon as I saw the website. A, it was very professional. B, I saw the lightsabers and immediately I fell in love with this lightsaber design. Like, boom, that was it. I'm like, wow, I need to have it. Um, it's a very very lovely uh, uh, hill design and um, the quality of the insulations, the electronics, the craftsmanship and uh, the communication of these guys is fantastic and all that together uh, made me instantly uh, basically buying a lightsaber from them because I really felt like yeah these, these guys have a fantastic product and um, they're newer on the market they're reasonably new to the uh, lightsaber market, but they're in there for uh, 100,000 percent basically. And it's all love for custom sabers. So they're really professional and they're knowledgeable. They know what they're doing. And um, I'm super excited. And this thing is darn good packed up. So I'm gonna cut it open. I can already see some of the outlines of the saber. So now to be careful not to scratch it up. I'm curious to know if she also holds uh, a battery charge so we can actually uh, immediately fire on and showcase how the saber works. Hopefully I uh, know how it operates because I never operated this type of soundboard before. And I believe this is a Pico Crumble dark side soundboard which I actually never owned before so I'm very excited for that as well because they are neat little soundboards with uh, a RGB functionality. And this thing actually has RGB as well. So we're gonna get over that in a full review, of course. Now, um, enough talking, let's take her out of the wrap. Ah, uh, darn, dude, that is amazing. Oh my God, I love the size of it. It's so amazing. Oh my God, jeez. Ah, oh, it is so beautiful, guys. Deep blade socket. Beautiful tri-cree LED in there, RGB. We have 
a sunken AV switch. We have this beautiful choking point upstairs in the emitter section with window emitter. We have this thumb screw for uh, adjusting or inserting the blade and then turn on the lightsaber. We know what, let's do it at the same time. We put in the blade here and then we're gonna turn her on with the blade inside. So we immediately go for the wow factor. Let me undo the thumb screw a little bit. That's really nice and smooth. Nice deep blade socket. And we just tighten up the uh, thumb screw. Nice and tight. Oh, this, this already feels amazing in the hand. Um, I love oh, the, 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 the cover tech wheel also looks amazing. It looks really, really good. Just look at it. So cute, so nice. Very different kind of design than I've seen before. Uh, really nice design. The pommel I love as well. You can see the speaker uh, in the bottom. As uh, bottom, and I think it's a 28. I think it's a 23 or 28 watt bass speaker. I will get the specs for you guys. Uh, don't worry. And um, so, uh, whew, moment of truth. Let's uh, see if the uh, fire's on. Oh yeah! Ooh, sit red button here. Nice. <laughs> oh what that is amazing holy crap good this is amazing my son comes to look as well he's like what what i want to see it i want to see it let me see it what how much dollar is it how many dollar it is yeah. <laughs> it's very cheap actually guys i will go over the uh the cost aspects etc in the uh, full review but you will be amazed if you look at the price range you have to pay for these sabers. It's super affordable. Okay, okay. I need it back. I need to still make Those the video. Are sponos. Okay. There's a penguin get the Star Wars. Okay. Oh, that is so nice. So, I think we can toggle this cyber in between different colors. Let me see if I can do that. If I hold the button. Is it like this? No. I think it was shimmer. Let's hold it again. Okay, it peeps. And then it's on. Oh, this is mute function. Oh, okay, we have mute. Okay, good. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I'm not familiar with the Pico Crumble soundboard yet. Oh, but this lightsaber feels amazing in the hand. Like, the size of it is just fantastic. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's just, it's, it's, I think it's a Saber Fort's uh, Apprentice Line class OD of the hill design. And I, I that's my favorite uh, thickness of hilt. So I absolutely love it. Gosh, this thing looks amazing. I like the slanted meter also being sideways instead of uh, front facing or back facing. That really gets a unique handling to the lightsaber, especially if you want to have the button facing towards you or to the side. So you can do the attacks while still operating the lightsaber with your uh, index finger or your middle finger. Uh, let's try to get it on a different color. Um, and it's not like this. I, I don't know actually how this works yet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think I have to hold it. No. Hold it. No. Hmm, I need to find it out, guys. I'm, I'm not very familiar with the Pico soundboard. But I don't want to give up yet. Hold it five seconds, maybe. Hold it longer, hold it longer. Okay, I just let it go. And hold it again. Maybe if I do it like one, two, no. Okay, I have to find it out. I, I don't know yet how to operate the soundboard. Um, let me just open the, uh, the pommel really quick. I just want to see how that looks from the inside. Ooh, nice long threads on the pommel. I like that. Looks really nice. So the chassis is in here. Now I believe this has an actual chassis as well. Yep, Delrin chassis, guys. This is no cheap uh, toy. Well, it's cheap in terms of purchase price. It's really affordable. You will guys see that. And uh, it has a recharge port here. So this you can find this uh, type of uh, Delrin. This is actually a Delrin chassis, exactly the same that Vader's Fold uses. And it has the recharge port like exactly like my Vader's Fold um, Hero. Of course, slightly different design, of course, their, their own design. 
and it doesn't come out all the way so it's stuck in this position that's really nice as well because it, the battery is not meant per se to take it out i think it actually can be taken out as well so swapping but normally you would charge your uh, hilt by the in hilt recharge port and it has the cool hidden uh saber trio logo um and it says uh, war warranty is void is serious tempered so that's also a really cool uh, little design there and it also immediately shows this is a Sabre Trio. No other Sabre company I've ever seen doing them something like this and I think that's a really cool feature because you will immediately know if you pick up this lightsaber um, you will need immediately know after you open the pommel that this is a Sabre Trio and I think that's a uh, nice uh, added uh, bonus there. Um, very smooth threads as well, let me put it in uh, correctly. See if the chassis is in there properly. Wow, it's really, really nice. Okay, I think I just have to push it in a little bit. E okay, maybe I just have to adjust the uh, chassis a little bit till it fits right in there. Okay, so it's all the way in there. It's just like uh, the operation of a Vader's Fold Saber. If you're not familiar with it, it's a very easy operation where I met it. And uh, you can, I believe you can also put in a kill key. Uh, let me see if there's a kill key here. No, in this case not. But you can put in a kill key, I believe. And then you can shut off the soundboard and preserve battery life. Um, but this uh, board also, I believe, has deep sleep mode. So it's going to last you a really long time. So let me turn it on one more time. Ah, oh, nice, nice bright red. Very bright. Uh, very responsive clash on uh, flash on clash. The swings are the swings are nice. Wow, this is really cool. I really really like the saber already. Absolutely fantastic. The guys at Saber Trio did an amazing job, guys. Uh, I'm gonna leave the description to this saber and uh, their other products in uh, this video's description so you can check it out. Full review will be this weekend and then I found out how to operate the full RGB elements of this saber. Um, I'm sorry, I feel a little bit ashamed that I don't know how to do it uh, directly uh, in this video but I believe that I will figure it out in a minute or five. Um, an absolutely mind-blowing lightsaber. Uh, for an absolutely fantastic price point uh, you guys will be amazed for the price point for these sabers I will put the description as I said uh, in the video so you can check out on that but these guys are absolutely fantastic their hilt is absolutely gorgeous absolutely gorgeous beautiful hilt design fantastic so I hope you like the videos guys and uh, stay around for this full review uh, this coming Saturday for this saber um, I'm gonna play more with it. It's just amazing balls. Absolutely fantastic. Love that bassy sound. Ah, very cool, guys. Thanks for watching, and uh, as always, stay scummy. Bye bye. <laughs>